Hi guys, in this video, ang pag-aaralan naman natin ay under pa din ng square root, but this time, kukunin natin yung square root of decimal. Square root of decimal. Okay, let's say for example, meron tayong given na p squared being equal to 0.81. So, kukunin natin ngayon yung value ng p. So, that being said, p is just equal to the square root of 0.81. Kaya lang, maglalagay tayo dito ng plus or minus sign. So, alam natin na um, p squared, kahit, posit, kahit negative yung given niya na number or yung, kahit negative yung value ni p natin, kapag in-square natin yun, automatic, it will become positive. It will become positive, which is nandito sa kay 0.81. So, that means ilalagay natin plus or minus. Kung maatatandaan ninyo yung lesson natin sa introduction to square root, sabi natin, P, uh, the square root of P dapat, the square root of X dapat, ang X natin is always positive. But, kapag nakalagay na P squared is equal to another number at kukunin natin yung square root non, so, yung P natin could be positive or negative. Okay, so, and, tin, uh, tinuro ko na yon Kung hindi nyo pa napanood, pwede nyo puntahan yung playlist natin on um, square root and cube root under number and operate, numbers and operation. Okay, so, i-disregard muna natin si 0 0.81 kasi decimal yan. So, baka malito kayo, baka mas mabigat sa inyo yung pag naka-decimal na siya. So, let's try to put it in a simple scenario. So, gawin natin munang whole number si 81. So, ano yung dalawang number na magkamuka na kapag sinolve natin, ay multiply natin ang sagot ay 81. So, we have 9 times 9 is equal to 81. So, alam natin ang 9 times 9 is 9 squared, which is also equal to 81. So, it is also equal to what? 9 equal to square root of 81. Okay. So, dito, itry natin ngayon kuhanin yung square root ng 0 0.81. So, isip tayo ngayon ng number na kapag pinagmultiply natin, ang magiging sagot ay 0 0.81. So, kung dito, 2 decimal yung minove natin. So, try natin dito sa kabila. So, P is equal to plus or minus square root of uh, so galaw lang tayo ng isang decimal. So since this is 9 this is 9, so try natin yung 0 0.9 oh, 0 0.9 So alam natin ang 0 0.9 is simply equal to ay, 0 0.9 square is simply equal to 0 0.9 times 0 0.9 being equal to 0. Point, dalawa yung place value ay yung, yung ano niya yung sa decimal niya so we have 0. 0.81 so alam natin na that's 0. 0.9 so 0. 0.9 square okay so that means p is simply equal to positive or negative 0. 0.9 so try natin ngayon yung lagi natin dito p is equal to 0. 0.9 or P is equal to negative 0 0.9. So, try natin ngayon si 0. Si 0 0.9 na try na natin. Ito siya. Alam natin na 0 0.81 din siya. How about negative 0 0.9 squared? So, that is equal to 0, negative 0 0.9 times negative 0 0.9 which is equal to positive 0 0.81. 